hey everybody, this is not a spring chick, and we're just hearing that Bernanke is not doing anything until after the fall election. <laughs> Boy, there's other things that don't happen until after the fall election, like Obamacare, oh, excuse me, oh, the affordable health care in many different parts of it. Well, for now, we're going to bring old Cam on with comments on the headlines of today. <laughs> <laughs> and it's all over for the Republicans. Well, they say it is because they said that uh, that it, things are so bad for the Republicans with Obamacare. I love it that they now totally own Obamacare because the, they said because of the a-holes that would not support them to kill the program, which they could have done, they said it was the biggest mistake that McConnell and, and Boyd Boehner ever made was not going with the killing of the thing. But all they had to do was cut the funding off. Obama could have done nothing. That's all they had to do. And that, but, okay, here's how it works is they said, did we suffer any damage from the shutdown? No, because 85% of the government was in operation all the time because that's how much is permanently funded. 85%. All they did was basically shut down things like going to the national parks and stuff like that, which mm -hmm. since it's in a crappy part of the year, people aren't doing anyway. Mm -hmm. So they, you know, they said that the, that the, 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 the Obama, well, here's what the guy said, Obamacare has so much destroyed the economy of this country and did, did so serious a damage to the health care <laughs> system, Republicans are going to have to work on it in order to save the health care of this nation. So they're screwed now because they didn't do what they should have done. And Obamacare hits new lows in the polls, and it is the fault of the Republicans, not him. Well, they wouldn't give him the money he needed. Okay, they asked Sebelius, they actually didn't ask her. They sent a court order to her from the local district uh, federal court to tell them how much money this site is costing. And she says, well, we don't actually have those figures on hand. <laughs> And then he said, that's why, he said, that's typical of a government agency. They, they hit, and he said, one well, of the guys says, well, I honestly can believe she doesn't know how much money she's spending because she's got a blank check because she works for the government. And can this marriage be saved? GOP and hard right groups. No. The hard right has been proved right in every instant. The Republicans are basically, okay, here what it is. The Republicans have been the defenders of the military. The Republicans now, the Republican leadership said F you to every person in, in, in the military that basically got a pay. Oh, here, right here. A hollow. I have a metal plate in my head from being shot. I have a hole over on this side. You know, like the bullet went like, and went out the other side. My, I have bullet holes from my knees all the way up here. I have a kidney that's gone. Uh, and, uh, and basically, they... You know, I would, I would have, lo I'm going to lose part of my pension if I'd have had my pension. And despite the fact that, you know, well, people are going to have to contribute. Well, no, there's a difference between a union man contributing and a guy that got the hell shot out of him in a war contributing. Like, they don't have, the guys that got butchered don't have a, they're not going to go get an opportunity to go to work again. The guys from the union can just simply go find another job. But the person that's on a disability, Pension, that ain't ever going to happen for that guy. And he saying, well, you're going to have to start contributing. I don't make any money because I'm, oh, I don't have any arms and have no legs. Well, you're going to have to go get a job because, you know, Boehner said, Boehner and all the Republican leaders, we, and John McCain, oh, John McCain, to say, he's, got, he's a disabled American vet. He knows what it's like. Uh, and uh, he said, well, they're going to have to contribute. It doesn't make any damn difference if they don't have any money, you know, because I'm John McCain. So, I don't think much of John McCain, folks. And Michigan lawmakers may act on separate abortion insurance. Well, yeah, because basically you, uh, okay, Obama lost big time yesterday when he said that you can't force an or you cannot force a religious organization that does not believe in, does not believe in abortion to fund abortions, and that basically is a killer for him because he's going to lose it when it hits the Supreme Court again because they've already told him that he cannot force people onto his program. Mm -hmm. He knows that you can't penalize him for doing it either because they, it is a tax. They can tax anybody, but you cannot force somebody to be on his health care program or to obey his rules. I mean, like that. The latest one, you know, like his court says, his people said. Well, the, oh, and I put it in this way, 
I used to make uh, what my father would call horse shooting ordinances, but they didn't quite leave, didn't quite spell it as shoot. They just put another letter in there. Mm. And he uh, and and here was the thing was in my era, the cowboy instead of kissing a girl and riding off of her in a sunset would pat his horse and ride off in a sunset. According to the Obama judges now, if the guy wants to marry his horse, that's perfectly acceptable in this country now because they've now went so far to the left that anything is legal now. Mm -hmm. And Detroit awaits final details on city-owned art. Well, they got to sell it all because the city's broke. They, they, you know, mm -hmm. it's not. Here's the thing: is the longer they take to sell it, the more the the less in value it becomes because it would. When you have a fire cell on 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 Da Vinci's and Go Gans and and um, and and mm -hmm. other people's work, you're not going to get anywhere near what you should have got. They should have sold it when they had a chance, and the unions wouldn't allow it. So. And bulldog gang members engaged in gun battle with Fresno officer. I know. I I, I, I spent a lot of my life building homes in Fresno, folks. I don't remember such a thing as a bulldog gang member. I know they had a Latino bulldogging. Gang. They had Latino gangs. They had Asian gangs. Is that because of Fresno State? A yeah, bulldogging? they're not. There aren't no bulldog gang members in Fresno. They they basically have the Nostra thing. They have all of these great. They have all the really good gangs in the United States are in Fresno. <laughs> I'm guessing what it means is they dress up in bulldog t-shirts and hats and go do things. Uh, yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. And Israel breaks up migrant protest. Because Israel wants some talk. Okay, here's it is. But while we're basically hung up on bringing all the people to the country illegally, every country in the world but the United States is throwing these illegals out of their country. They don't want them there. Obama is the only person in the universe, the only world leader. Well, we welcome all of the people in our country that want to come here. Mm -hmm. And clouds over Hawaii's rooftop solar growth hint at U.S. battle. Yeah, because, they, oh, here's a good one. Guess whose uh, guess who's solar panels are going into all the rooftops in Hawaii? Whose? The Chinese, you know why? Oh, because of the cost? Because of the cost. They're undercutting. Everything Everything in China comes in by boat. And it, they're, it's cheap. Oh, they're che closer to Hawaii? They're closer to Hawaii. Their distributorship mm -hmm. is closer to Hawaii than the, uh, than the mainland USA is. And California Bay Area Commuter Rail's union sued to enforce that end of, contract that ended strike. Uh, well, because what happened was after the, they were forced to they were forced to do the end of strike by court order, and then the unions changed the game plan like they did, and um, that well we're going to accept the original offer, not the one that we had, not the final one. The original offer they turned down was better than the one they accepted by court order. So now they're striking to enforce the one that they never agreed to to begin with. Mm -hmm. And India removes U.S. embassy security barriers in SPAT. Oh yeah, let's see Obama pissed off. Obama's pissed off the Brazilians, I have them this morning. Uh, two days ago, they arrested one of, the em one of the ambassadors to the United Nations, tossed her in a drug cell, strip searched her, and did everything else you can think of. And basically, they are on the verge of halting all diplomatic relations with the United States. By taking the barriers down, they have now said, you want to kill the American ambassador and his people? Do it, because we want the sons of bitches out of it. That's what he said. We want the sons of bitches out of our country after the, after the indignities mm -hmm. they caused. They don't really like women in high places, so what happens? As far as they're concerned, the Obama people had an ambassador assaulted, just mm -hmm. to make a point. And e-cigarette road could block new EU tobacco rules, diplomats. I know, because they, uh, they eat, they're wanting, the, okay, everybody is hung up on regulating something that doesn't even have tobacco in it, which is, I mean, as far as they're concerned, okay, it would be like, um, uh, here, ooh, this is my new e-cigarette, ooh, mm -hmm. it's my e-cigarette, can't you tell it, it's a bottle of water. But if you call it an e-cigarette and it just had nothing, this is what's in a lot of the e-cigarettes. It's nothing oh. but water vapor, and they want they want to regulate <laughs> it like it was a cigarette. There's no danger in inhaling water. Yeah, I don't know. It's crazy. And a Monty bubble is in from the Mark Twain of the Animal Kingdom. Okay, um, Herbie Daddy said it. Age gets eventually catches up with everyone. <laughs> Oh, <laughs>